This is just a quick teardown of a Sling Media Sling Box SB200-100. Pretty simple design. These screws for the rubber feet are kind of nice because a lot of times the adhesive fails or the feet slip off. Those screws are only holding the rubber feet on. There are two long screws that go all the way through the case to the top cover. And then there's two other screws at the bottom that were over here which screw into some plastic nuts that hold the circuit board on. Also, there's one screw by the uh, input-output ports in the middle that holds the board to the frame in a third place. Once you remove the long screws, it's just a simple matter of tipping this out. And you're inside. Nothing too fancy. Zoom in here just a little bit. So I believe that should be flash storage. That's the memory. That's a Texas Instruments digital media processor, as it's labeled. <laughs> I believe this circuitry here is the control circuitry for the RF outputs. As you can see, it's all in that general area, along with some uh, cutouts, which I believe are for isolation purposes. Then there's this chip here, which I'm not 100% certain what it is. I was having some difficulty when looking it up, but I believe it's a tuner chip of some sort. Also, I thought it was kind of odd. I'm not sure why they put this on the solder mask, but it's labeled that all unmarked components are 0.1 microfarad capacitors. I'm not sure who that notes for since most of those are components that would be a pick and place machine, not human interaction. But, yeah. And then uh, to get to the other side of the board, it just kind of flips out. I have it kind of pinned in right now because I put it in incorrectly, but it flips out and bottom side of the board is just, oops, let's zoom out a little. Bottom side of the board is just a bunch of passive components, some bypass caps for the processors and whatnot. But, yeah, pretty simple design. Not a lot of parts to it. Easy to take apart. I doubt they really intended it to be serviceable by any means, but it definitely made it so it was easy to put together. So, yeah, thanks for watching.